guys, Andy from Tinkercrate. Let's jump right into how to build and play your gravity game. Slide the two support pieces onto the base. Remove the backing from the blue sticky felt and attach it to the base. Make sure the edge of the tab lines up with the edge of the big support piece. Attach four pieces of double stick foam to your base piece, two on each side of the felt. Make sure that there's a space between the two pieces of sticky foam on the side without the tab. Apply your stickers to the game board piece so that the 10 is around the circle at the narrow end and the 50 is around the circle at the fat end. Stick your game board piece down over the felt. Slide the locking piece with two holes through the narrow end then secure it in place with the other locking piece. Attach the acrylic rods by first sliding one end through the slit in the large side. Then press the other side through the two small holes on the narrow end. Grab your ball and you've completed your gravity game construction. The object of your gravity game is simple. Try to get the ball up the acrylic rods as far as you can. If you get it in the first well, it's 10 points, second, 20, third, 30, all the way up to 50 points. To do this, start with the ball resting on the narrow end. Spread the rods apart to start the ball rolling, then squeeze them together. If you do this at the right time, the ball should shoot up the ramp. You can then open the rods again to drop the ball into one of the wells. Try setting a game up with your friend. Who can get the most points in 5 tries, or 10? If it's a little bit difficult to rotate your rods, try pulling the ends out of the holes just slightly. This will make them rotate more smoothly and will make the game a little bit easier. Another way to make your game a little bit easier is to place a small notebook or book under the narrow end of your game. To make your game a little bit harder, use the extra laser cut pieces on the thick side of your board. Thanks for checking out the tutorial and good luck mastering the game. For some other awesome DIY projects, including this balancing bird, check out your Tinkerzine. Alright, thanks for watching, and as always, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you next time.